drawn from seasoned statistics can sometimes illuminate potential areas of improvement. What's up, YouTube? Rich Gamer 997 here. here. Today we're back on MLB The Show 20. If you guys we enjoyed this video, make sure to leave me a like, make sure to leave me a comment, and yeah, please don't forget to subscribe. On the show. Let's Coming up, play. we've got a good matchup in store between the Baltimore Orioles and the St. Louis Cardinals. Get ready for Cardinals baseball next. Austin Warner will be on the mound for the series opener. What do we need to know here, Danny? Hey, you can't always judge a pitcher by the numbers. I know the ERA is into the fours coming into this start, but he's actually a pretty solid pitcher. And every once in a while, he can throw some decent games in there. It's not easy hey, having an ERA. He's out. Stepping up to the plate, Rio Ruiz. The Orioles looking for more here Rio. in this game's opening frame. Rio Ruiz. The 0-2. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will end the inning. Orioles settle for one. We'll move on to the bottom half of inning number one. Six days. That's crazy. Why would they move me to six? Detours and jumped and scope. So coming to the plate, Richard O'Neill. First shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. This guy's had a super season so far, and we're well into the baseball season, so this isn't a fluke. He's been swinging the bat great all year. High in the air out to center field. Mm, got underneath Florida that one. He's underneath this one. One gone. Mm. Play ball. Now with the plate, Rio Ruiz. One in, one out, and one on here in the inning. Rio Ruiz. Pulled toward right center field. Right fielder is on the run. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Hold on to it. Hold on to it. What's the play ball? Ready for another chance? Go Richard O'Neill. He flew field. out in his last at bat. First pitch oh. coming. Here it is. And he connects with it. Not this one's hit not. deep out to left center field. And that is off the wall. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. He's not, the more still can't tell. The they, more they stay the, the same. distance this in the ball. He's standing the there. Like that ball is this hit is hard is no as different. hell. He's There's no way anyone's going to catch it, but the fucking the CPU can't tell that. Just have to settle for a double. Coming to the plate now, Andrew Kisner. He's got a chance to add to this early lead as he'll bat with a couple of guys in scoring position. Fielded cleanly. The tag gets one. Throw not nearly in time as he reaches it first. Almost fell out over. Digging in to try it again. Estevan now Florio, back. runner in scoring position with Sugan. Florio. And he gets around on one and hits it high and deep to straightaway right. But he'll get there as he flags it down just shy of the wall. And with that, the side is retired. One left for the Orioles. Ready for another shot now. Richard O'Neill, one for two with a double on the ledger so far. First pitch on its way. 
Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Come on, go, 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 go. He takes the turn and heads for second. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. So a good job of going the other way here as he checks in with the one-out double. And as you see there, he's currently pacing this Redbirds team in that category. So striding in, now Andrew Kisner. Kepner. He reached on a fielder's Andrew. choice previously. Andrew Kisner. Kisner. Rippity, rip it up. And he gets him to pop it up on the right side of the infield. Urias is there, two down. At the plate, Adam Frazier. Now batting, third baseman, Adam Frazier. A 01 pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Come on, go hard, you're scoring. Go hard. Why did he Daniel go back, you dick? You were supposed to, to run. This one away and that uh. Well, I guess he's conserving his energy. So striding forward now, DJ Stewart. He's working on a one for three thus far. Has a look, now the pitch. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. O'Neill is on the warning track as he hauls it in for a loud out number one. And he'll indeed move up 90 feet, putting runners at the corners now with one away. Digging in, Rio Ruiz. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Rio Ruiz. Here now the 2 2. And he turns on one, sending it high and deep to right. Going back is the right fielder. And that one is gone on a two strike count with two away in the inning. They seem to forget that the game started a while ago. That's ball four. Digging in and looking for more, Richard O'Neill. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Strike one to start the at bat. Now the pitch. Back up the middle. And that'll get on by into center field for a leadoff single. Hey, this guy's obviously seeing the ball right now. That's another hard hit single. Three for four right there. He's looking super solid at the plate. Ready now, Andrew Kisner. He was retired after popping out in his last at bat. Yeah, Matty, it looked like he got fooled a little bit. A little bit out front, ended up popping out. Expect him to be a little bit more leery of the breaking pitch to save it. And as a result of that errant throw back in, he'll advance 90 feet here and move up from second to third. You can't teach that, Matty. The ability to, for a right-handed hitter to shoot a ball through the 3-4 hole, unmatched. Riding into the box, Adam yeah, Frazier. It was a fly out for him in his Adam. last trip. Yeah, and I'm sure he'd like a base hit of some sort right here, Matty. But hey, you know what? Another fly out wouldn't be all that bad. If he can get it deep enough, he should be able to drive in a nice run with a sack fly. On to first, but not in. Full four, take the base. Three, three. That hit him, first base. At the plate, Richard O'Neill. He singled his last time up. First pitch coming. Here it is. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. This guy loves to drop the head on those pitches down and in. I'm shocked he went in there, but he's able to jump ahead and get away with it. Line drive to left. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Into the box now, Jose Martinez. Struggling so far in this one and looking to erase his 0 for 4 ball game right here. Skied into straightaway right. Right fielder giving chase. He gets there to put it away, but the runner tags and breaks for third. And he's safe. What's the play ball? Three. This game had its moments, but it got out of hand pretty quick. Always nice when you can close to a six-run win. Save your closer for another day and let everyone in on the action. 14-8, the final score here.
St. Louis took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Austin Warner earned his fifth win of the year. Keegan Aiken gave up a whopping nine earned runs in the losing effort. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Four hours and 19 minutes. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. A good one. On Play ball. You're up. Out. He's out. out. Three. Three. You're up. So stepping in, Rio Ruiz, and he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Pops this one up. Right fielder coming on. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Three up, three down for the Orioles. We'll go to the bottom. Yeah, they move me down to seven in, spot. Richard O'Neill. He comes in today, leading the National League in hitting this year. What a season this guy's having. He's right up there among the RBI leaders, and he's uh, awfully dangerous. Just got the bat the hand out on, on that one. One there. The relay not in time as he beats the throw by a step. <laughs> Why didn't he stop running? He didn't stop running at all. Just like that. He didn't even stop running at second. Stepping in, Richard O'Neill. He'll now swing back. it from the left side oh, right here. And this is the Richard. side of the plate this guy oh, loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left handed. No, I didn't go anywhere. Right Tapia will wait on it. Damn, that and ball is second out of the hung game. up there. What is it? Let's play ball. Even the other O'Neill bats now, before me. What the hell? O'Neal. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Lined hard toward right center. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. Come on, you're down. You're down. And they'll have runners at the corners following I think the one out single. Thought that idiot was going to stop. Looks like so. they might finally have something going after that base hit. First and third, one out. And maybe now they can get something started. Yeah, you could tell the third base coach was going to be aggressive right there, right? A nice read by both him and the base runner to take that extra base and put them in scoring position. They've been, they've been struggling right now to get guys in scoring position. Swinging a soft liner. And despite being down 0 2, he delivers anyway with a big base hit. And this will come in far too late. He's in there at third. Boy, I'd say what that's a big RBI late in the game here. They take a 2 0 lead, D Road. The way the pitching's been for them tonight, they're sitting in a pretty good spot. Yeah, Dan, they've gotten great pitching all game long. And all that extra run can do is give you a little bit more confidence. You don't have to pitch with such tension out there. Fearful of making one Jack mistake. Flaherty, the pitcher, he has one for two. Oh, shit. Hey, look at one pitch right here. Come on now. That's what's up. Pitcher getting his head on. Michael Rucker. Two runs, seven hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. Or Michael Rucker, whatever one of them. This is on the ground Michael. over the first. The second for one. <laughs> Relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. Cards forced to settle for one. save of the year so far. A 2 nothing Our finish today. St. Louis wrote an important six. Damn, they scored at a double play. <laughs> what, I skipped first base? <laughs> I guess it is a double play.
We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. What's the play ball? He stays! He's out! Three! Out! Three! So here's the cleanup hitter, Richard O'Neill. First shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. This guy's having a really good year for his age, but this is something we've seen a lot lately. Well, the play's been made, and that retires the side. Didn't get by. It didn't get by. Digging in for his second at bat, Richard O'Neill. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. There's a ball ripped toward the gap, gap in left center. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Rounds the corner and is headed <laughs> home. And the runner is in from second. Throw won't get him. And this is a dream start of an inning for the guys at the plate and a nightmare for the pitcher and the defense. No outs, runner at first and second, and he just ropes a triple to start what could be a huge inning. Already a rough frame, and there are still no outs. Anthony Santander the next to bat. They've got two already home in the inning and a potential third waiting in the wings only 90 feet away. Now, the one two hit on the ground to third Machado has it throw to first is in time but meanwhile the runner is in to score two runs already home and now you can make it three ball four three 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 Trying to pick things up where we left off, Richard O'Neill, and he's looking to add on to his two RBI game from earlier. Slapped hard the opposite way, and the cards are going to wind up with extra bases again as they are on fire right now. And he will pull into second with a two-out double. Wow, he's getting a visit from the pitching coach, but I think double. it's a little too late for him to turn things around. I mean, he's given up six runs, so. I'm not sure how much the talking is going to help. He just doesn't have it today. The Mets. Time for you to go hit the showers, buddy. <laughs> now batting, Anthony Santander. Now runner in scoring Left position with two gone. Anthony. O'Neal at second yes. with two Anthony. down. Hey, let's go, big fella. He's right here. Hit on the ground to third. Taken get in out, by get Machado. Out, get out. Throw to first will get him yep, easily, and the out. side is retired. Got jammed up. Jammed up. Stepping into the box, Richard O'Neill. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this A.B. Hey, I'm surprised he went to that spot in his own. This guy's known for being a down-and-in hitter. Don't expect too many pitches going in that spot. Line drive to center field. That's in there. Base hit. Frazier is on his way home. He will score. And they now lead by nine. So he's able to come through here with two away. And that's a good time to check out our RBI leaders on the league leaderboard. And as you see, he's right up there among league leaders in that department. Settling in now, Anthony Santander. He was a ground out victim last time up. Anthony Santander. He's driving. Let's go right here. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Scooped right, up. Right here, right here, right here, right here. On to first, and it's in time as they're finally able to... Get out of it. Coming to the plate now, Richard O'Neill. He came through with an RBI single in his last at-bat. O'Neill. Here comes the first pitch. Swing and a liner. Get down, get down. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. 
There you go. Nice work. Nice work. Loud noises right here, fellas. Hey, he's going to have to mix it up a little bit more because they are on his stuff. Stepping up now, I Anthony Santander. Yeah, as the that switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. One of the things this guy would like to do from the left side is swing it a little bit. Meanwhile here, the throw down to second is not in time, and it's a stolen base. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. And think about it. In game one of this series, they've already had to go deep into their bullpen. This could affect them for the rest of the weekend if they don't get really good starting pitching. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Round it hard, round it hard. Fam, there to put it away and finally put an in. Wow, a nine out save. That's three full innings. You don't see that very often these days. It's awfully nice to have a guy in the back end of your bullpen that can pitch that kind of one. Four for five. For hell of a day at the job. The only thing I was missing was a home run. I got a triple, a second base, a first base, and couldn't get the home run to, for the cycle. <laughs> that sucked. Come so close all the time, but never get the cycle. But that's going to do it for me tonight, guys. If you guys enjoy this video, make sure to leave me a like. Make sure to leave me a comment. And yeah, please don't forget to subscribe. Let's see if we can get 10 likes on this video. And I will see you guys in another one. Make sure to wear your mask, wash your hands, and yeah, be kind to each other.